Hello everyone. Today we will be presenting on residual analysis, which is a statistical technique used to evaluate the fit of a model to a set of data. Here is the table of content. Introduction, definition of residuals, assumptions of linear regression, interpreting residual plots, outliers and influential points, application of residual analysis and conclusion. Moving forward to introduction. When we fit a statistical model to a set of data, we are trying to find a relationship between one or more independent variables and a dependent variable. This relationship can be used to make predictions about the dependent variable based on the values of independent variables. However, no model is perfect and there will always be some degree of error or variability in the predictions of the model. Residual analysis is a way to examine this error and determine whether the model is a good fit for the data. Moving forward to the definition of residuals. We can define residuals as the difference between observed and predicted values of the response variable. The residual for each observation is the difference between predicted values of y and observed values of y. Here we have the equation that is E is equal to y minus y cap where E stands for error, y stands for actual values and y cap stands for predicted values. Assumptions of linear regression are as follows. Linearity. The relationship between the dependent and independent variable should be linear. Independence. The residual should be independent of each other, meaning that the value of one residual should not influence the value of another. Homoscedasticity. The variance of residuals should not be constant across all levels of independent variables. Normality. The residuals should be normally distributed and follow a bell-shaped curve. Interpretation of residual plots. Residual plots are graphically representations of residuals and can provide insights into the validity of regression model. There are several residual plots including, including scatter plot, histogram, and normal probability plots. A scatter plot of residuals can help identify patterns or outliers in the data. A histogram plot can show the distribution of the residuals and the normal probability plot can help help determine if the residual follows a normal distribution. Outlier and influential points. Outliers are extreme values that deviate significantly from the rest of the data. In residual analysis, outliers indicate data errors or represents important information about the underlying process being modeled. There are several methods for detecting outliers in residual analysis, including standardized residuals, Cox, distance and leverage standardized residuals are residuals that can have been divided by divided by their standard deviation the cox distance measures the influence of each observation on the regression coefficient leverage measures how far an observation is from the center of the predictor values variables applications of residual analysis Residual analysis has many practical applications in fields such as finance, economics, and engineering. For example, residual analysis can be used to evaluate the performance of investment portfolios, analyze economic trends, and optimize manufacturing processes. In addition, residual analysis can be used to compare different models and to select the best one for a given dataset. By comparing the residual of the other models, researchers can determine which model the best fits the data. Conclusion Residual analysis is a powerful tool for evaluating the accuracy of regression models and identifying the patterns and outliers in the data. By understanding the assumptions of residual analysis and interpreting the residual plots, researchers can gain valuable insights into the underlying process being modeled. Whether used for the practical applications or the theoretical research, residual analysis is essential for anyone working with the regression models. Thank you.